a bright and sunny morning just do some rain later on so I thought I'd take the opportunity to come out and do a bit of sketching over at Low Bar. The sun's right in my eyes this way but I'll obviously be looking that way I think but we'll see when we get down there so let's see how we get on. So we're, gonna head, we're gonna head down this way tuck ourselves in amongst the rocks there on the left and on the side of the field and sketch with the KC paints. I've just got to remember to bring the dog with me he's over there eating seaweed at the moment here I am just setting up my gear, everything I've got for sketching fits into that uh, little green rucksack, the stool, the red, little red fisherman stool. Goes on the outside of it, strapped on. And I've got a couple of sketchbooks in there. Hello Basil. There's two sketchbooks in there, that's an old lunchbox which contains my paints and uh, pencils, charcoals etc. I've got a paint tube, paintbrush tube. I use a couple of old uh, pencil cases, metal ones, for my uh, palettes, mixing palettes. They're like, uh, there they are, look, two, two little metal boxes and they open out and give me four palettes. Bottle of water there. Another thing that came from one of the kids' old lunch boxes. And then put the casein paint this is, and putting that out onto the metal metal uh, pencil cases now. And there I am, you can see them there on the right hand side, which I use as some palettes. That's the view that I'm looking at from where I'm sitting, down towards the lizard, Mullion and the Lizard. We're on low bar at the moment. Just trying to, to uh, sketch this scene out, holding the book up, the sketchbook up, so you can actually see what I'm doing. I just was messing about with a few ca different camera tripods and angles and things lately. As you can see, I didn't quite get it right there. I chopped my head off. And that's where we were at at that point, and there's the, uh, the pallets and the box with all the stuff in. And this is the view. This is March and look at the weather, fantastic. Basil looks like he's stuck to the rocks. Lovely morning. Great to be out. So back into this uh, casein sketch. So you mix this casein paints with your water and you can have it as thin as you want. Or is it, and then it, you can uh, make it thicker, you can thicken it up, so I add a little bit less water as you go to layer on top of the more transparent washes that you put down earlier. And it dries really fast, which is why I like it. Because then I can still use some of my oil, oil painting techniques of layering in one 20 minute sketch like this outside, it's fantastic. This, is, this will be about 15 20 minutes. This one, it's just to give me an impression of uh, that view looking down. Nothing too accurate, it's just a, just a pleasure to be out sketching, to be honest, on a morning like this. And that's it, all packed up, ready to go back in the bag. Just leaving the uh, sketch to dry off for a bit. Those uh, thicker opaque whites that I put in for the highlights of the waves have a chance to dry before I fold the sketchbook up otherwise it will stick together and then we'll end up with a bit of a mess and that's what we ended up with when we finished well thanks for watching hope you enjoyed it and uh, bye for now